friends, welcome back to our channel. Today we're going over our upper body workouts for the week. Like we mentioned in our last video, we're doing an eight week challenge journey to lose a little bit of weight. And we're doing a program from Coach Mark Carroll and it has three lower body days, which is on our last video and two upper body days. We go over our upper body workouts for the week. Um, talk a little bit about cardio and we've also been doing some abs, so. All right, Tuesday. So this is the first upper of the week. Uh, we start with um, some warm up that we kind of, it's its random. It's just some arm circles. Very unstructured. Um, bands. Michael said it's like I'm foiling my arms around in this, but I'm warming them up. Yeah, something's happening. Same as lower body days, we start the first lift with a series of uh, increasing weight to get for a working set weight. Um, the first workout is dumbbell shoulder press. This is four sets of eight with a three second pause for the first four reps and then four in the Okay, and then we're going to do pull-ups after that. Um, we're really working on trying to do an unassisted pull-up. Um, I just, uh, we're, we're just not there yet. So, but yeah. like, we started with like the heaviest band and now we use some, some lighter ones. Yeah. So here we are um, doing pull-ups and this is four sets of six and with the three second pause at the top for the first three reps. And then we move into a superset of dumbbell lateral raise and one arm row. We start with the lateral raises, four sets of 12, pausing for three seconds at the top for the first six. Really try not to swing these. It's better to lower the weight if you have to because you want to be able to hold them at the top and really get the tension up there. And then following these, we're doing one arm rows, four sets of 12, pausing at the bottom for the first six, and then six. And then to finish out this upper body workout, uh, we are doing a super set of hammer curls and tricep extensions. So this is just three sets of 15 for the hammer curls and three sets of 12 for the lying tricep extensions. The second upper body session is on Fridays. So we're gonna start off with a, well, our little warm up. Of course. <laughs> then we're going, our first lift is a dumbbell chest press. And this is four sets of eight with the three second pause at the bottom of the rep for the first four reps. Then we do pull-ups again. I think it is important that we do it. Well, I mean, it's part of the program, but also I, I've heard you should do it multiple times a week if you really want to get the pull-up. Uh, but so this one is four sets of six and the pause is at the bottom. And I also switch my grip for this because I think it's hard to do the pronated grip for both sets. So in this we're doing, what is this called? I think it's just a neutral grip. Neutral grip. That's why. Not this way. Not this way. After the pull-ups, we go into a super set. So this is a... 45 degree prone dumbbell lateral raise. This is four sets of 12 with the three second pause at the top for the first six into the seated row. And that is four sets of 12 with the pause when you have it closest to your body. To finish this workout, we do rope pulled neck. It's just four sets of 15. And then we've incorporated some abs uh, because I feel like my, my core is so weak. Like just it, it really, general. yeah, it, it affects like my squats and my deadlifts and I just, I need to do some work here. Yeah. I know that to show the abs, you need to lose the body fat, but I yeah. think we need to build up the ab strength for all aspects of life. Yeah. Uh, so currently we're doing it on the cardio days that we're doing and after the Tuesday uh, upper body workout. We just do, I mean, I personally do like a... Uh, the, the rope curl? Yeah. The, or the rope crunch. Mm -hmm. um, 
the hanging one. Hanging like braids. And I'll do, oh, oh, what's that called when you hold it? Oh yeah, like a reverse, reverse crunch. crunch. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then, um, oh, I've been doing dead bug. Hopefully yeah, hopefully, hopefully there's a clip of this here. Yeah. <laughs> um, of all of these, really. Yes. <laughs> yeah. But we just do a couple of them. Uh, I, yeah, I literally do two. Do you? three Maybe. sets of some? Oh, I do like four sets. So clearly, we're on our own journey um, for the abs, but I'm doing it. I kind of mentioned cardio. Uh, we started with two. Two days of cardio on Sundays and Thursdays. We're adding a third day uh, on the second or the first upper body day. Uh, so for the cardio, we just do like 25 minutes, uh, one minute of intense uh, work, and then one minute slow chill cardio. Uh, and then uh, we usually like I'll do like the bike, the elliptical, the treadmill and whatever I'm feeling that day. I try to split it up because 25 minutes feels like a long time to be on one machine, so. It's really important for me is um, just making it so I don't hate it. <laughs> like the other day we did the stairs at, outside. I don't recommend doing that. And Mark Carroll doesn't recommend doing that either because it really, it killed us. Uh, we were struggling to walk uh, the next few days and struggling to do the leg workouts. Yeah. But that's just because we're not used to it. Maybe. I don't know. We tried it. We we're just trying to have fun with the cardio is my point. In addition to those three cardio days, we are doing a step goal. We started off 10,000 steps as our goal and then we increased it to 12,000. And now for those last four weeks, we are going to aim for 15,000. Can we do it? Yes, of course. We can. <laughs> now I'm going to get up even earlier to so get a little more. I usually do it with a big chunk in the morning and then a little lunch walk and then a little walk later. They say that someone was always like, oh, you should spread it out throughout the day, but... What, I'm gonna leave my house like 10 times a day? No. Really? That's our cardio, upper body, abs, all that. Currently doing to try to lose a little weight and we'll see how it goes. We'll update you guys in our... Not our next video, probably, but in a video at the end of all of this, we will probably in four weeks when yeah. we've done all, all of this. We've got we've got four more weeks left of the previously mentioned eight week thing that we're doing. Okay, so you know if you want to see how it goes, just stay tuned. Subscribe, like, comment, please. comment, hit that bell. Let me let me know what you want to see. <laughs> we're probably well. But we're gonna do some food videos. Yes, we are. We're gonna, the next one, you, you can see what we're eating, which is very important. <laughs> okay, thank you for watching. Goodbye. <laughs>